In addition to providing medications and treatment for their substance use disorder, uh, nursing is also responsible for making sure we're addressing any co-occurring medical or psychiatric issues that the patient may present with when they've come into treatment. It is a very vast and there's a variety of, med of issues that may uh, come up that we when we're assessing the patient. So that may be something as simple as a wound. I will just mention this, for example, a heroin user who's, who's shooting up may end up having a pretty substantial wound that they need to have treated that may be infected, that may be needing to have um, further treatment, soaks, things like that. There are people that have liver disease from the alcohol use. We would be treating that individual. They may develop ascites, which is a term that is about um, just getting distended from a lot of fluid near the, around the liver. Uh, people are very uncomfortable. They may have sleep disorders. Uh, so we sometimes have the patients um, go on a CPAP so that they can go good night's rest. It's very critical for their recovery that people are able to sleep. And so um, I think the myth sometimes is just give people pills and we will treat Everything can be treated with a pill. That's not necessarily true. We provide medication, but we also provide some of these other ancillary pieces such as a CPAP or heating pad or a quiet room to help them sleep better.